chapter 5, gas volume, pages 89 and 90, exercise 5e. Okay, gas volume is almost all empty space. <laughs> you look at a balloon and it's just a few molecules of the gas bounce around in there, but it's mostly empty space. We make the assumption that gas molecules don't interact with each other very much which means that a mixture of gases will act the same as a pure sample. And so, we can develop this information, and the big keys are seeing STP, or standard conditions, or these conditions. If you know that you have a gas, or a mixture of gases, at STP, also call at standard conditions or zero <coughs> degrees Celsius and one atmosphere of pressure this will always be true one mole of this gas will occupy 22.41400 liters of volume seven sig figs this is given okay on the conversion sheet and it's sort of automatic. If you see STP, you're going to use this. If you see standard, you're going to use this. If you see those conditions and you know you have a gas, you're going to use this conversion factor. All right. So let's take a look at what the problems looks for. And that's the other side of this. If you don't have these, then you cannot use these because a gas that's not at standard conditions will not occupy this volume. You put a gas under a high pressure, it will occupy a smaller volume. If you heat up a gas to above zero degrees Celsius, it will occupy a much larger volume. Okay? So, STP matches up with this, but it's an exclusive relationship. All right. So here are your problems, write them down, hit pause, try the work, come back. Ready? Pause. Okay, so once again, when you have one value, you start with that one. We have to get a relationship between moles and volume at STP, and that's clear that that's 22.41400 right there and it's right on your conversion sheet right there very nice okay so we know we're at STP so we can use that the moles has a 1 associated with it and we've got 22.414 liters moles cancels we're left with liters two sig figs and this problem gets real easy real fast I get on my calculator 179.312 or thereabouts so how will we have to write this number to two sig figs there's only one way that's using exponential notation it's a big number. It's going to have a positive exponent. So 1.8 times 10 to the 2 positive. There you go. Second problem, just a simple one number to start with, 973 milliliters of gas that is a mixture of butane and methane at standard conditions. If I see standard conditions, I know I'm using 22.4. If I don't see standard conditions, I know I'm not allowed to use that. So we're going volume to moles. Well, the volume we have to use is liters, so we have to convert. That's a metric to metric conversion. You better remember that there are a thousand milliliters per one liter. And once we're at liters, we can get to moles easily. The 1 goes with the moles. 
22.41400 goes with the liters. Liters cancels. Moles is all we have left. Three sig figs here. Metric to metric, that's an infinite number of sig figs. And that's seven. So the answer has three sig figs. So we fire through. 973 divided by 1000 divided by 22.414 and I get 0 0.0434 moles. Okay, that's all there is to it. It's important to remember that standard conditions for gases you will use this conversion factor but if it's not standard then you can't. Okay.